All right, I'm in the throne room right now. We've got Battle of the Bastards going. Jon Snow here. He's going to whip the sword out. Let's pause it, though. I want to get out of the throne room. So let's take a look. Let's turn this off. And I'm actually in a different throne room. So I got Booster right here. And this is probably about like a, I don't know, 105 foot, not foot, uh, inches, something like that. Because this is a 75 inch. Um, and yeah, so this is, you know, a little bit bigger. But, okay, Booster, let's go. Let's take a look. Oh, the batteries are here. Um, and I'm just going to give a, a, a walk through here. I saw another YouTube video um, like this, so I just wanted to do something similar. I've got a few different windows here set up uh, for different things. I'll get back to this eventually. Um, but I'll talk about like the setup that I have here. These, these are a little bit bigger than I thought they would be. Um, actually, where did those go? Uh, let's see. So I'll put this photos here. I'll go here. I'll pop this out here. And then I can talk about these here. I'll close that. So right now, uh, let's just say that I'm working. Like I'm working. I'm working in the office, taking a break. Um, so I'm going to stand up and then we'll take a look at the hallway, what we have here. So this is a real photo that we have framed here. So, uh, or like a painting of this matchbox, Mineta Tavern, one of my favorite places. Maybe I just have uh, some bone marrow from there, just as a reminder of delicious food. Let me make sure I'm recording. And okay, and then this other photo, that our framed uh, illustration or map, it's where my wife and I met, and it happens to be where this line was recorded. You are not serious people. Yeah, so we met in the same karaoke bar where this line is said. And then going in here a little bit uh, crass. I wouldn't really have it set up this way. But if you have a goal of reading a page a day, you might set uh, a book up where you want to read and where you're going to come back multiple times a day and read you know, a paragraph or two at a time. And then we'll go back through the hallway here. Uh, I'm, I want to take a break. I'm going to eat a snack. But first, I want to check my macros to see uh, how I'm doing here. And we'll take a look, 1,400 calories remaining. Yeah, I've got my fitness pal here. Uh, the, the protein, I can add some more protein, get some more protein in here, and I can go to, I think my food diary would be here. And let's take a look at what I've eaten today. <laughs> it looks like I've eaten like a toddler, <laughs> just chicken nuggets today. So I'm gonna go eat a, eat a healthy snack, and we'll go and add some food. And let's see, so, something recent, oh, more, more <laughs> adult food, Gushers. Uh, so, some in and out here. Maybe, maybe something a little bit healthier here. So maybe just a, a handful, like an ounce of almonds. And an interesting thing with this is that if you get close enough, if, you, if the screen is close enough, you can just tap. And let's go add checked. Pretty cool. So sometimes you might want to tap if you're imagining like walking around. And then I have this article from Strong First in the kitchen. So this is an article by Joey Yang, a Strong First instructor, kettlebell expert. And the reason I might have it here is just a nudge in the right direction. So the reason that I have it in, uh, hold on, let me pull up the, there we go. Here's the plan. So some goblet squats, get ups, some pull ups. And the reason I have it in the kitchen is to just get a little bit of a nudge because in the garage, I have a lot of cardboard <laughs> that I'm going to cover up with this, but I also have the home gym here. So let's see. And then another thing you could do is um, have this set up or pull this up. And then maybe I, I do the workout here. I have the kettle, grab the kettlebells, whatever I need while I do the workout, I can make it really big and let's zoom in. So yeah, maybe I have a huge here, but also maybe I just want to actually like move it from the oh, shoot, digital world to the physical world. Um, and my shin hurts, but uh, yeah, so I could take this, write it like I have some chalk here and I can, you know, write it here and make the chalkboard noise um 
and then I'll have that here, which is actually what I did. So this is, um, or I, I've done this in the past, but I was copying from my phone, but you can imagine it might be a little more convenient with the goggles here, uh, the Vision Pro here, and then I can pull up another workout, write it somewhere else here and just transfer things over. I'm not actually like right now going to be doing workouts with uh, the headset on, but eventually maybe these get smaller and I'll actually be able to do that and maybe, yeah, be able to just do the workout here. And you can see, let me just cover this up. Uh, let's see. So that's kind of the end of like this demo setup that I had. Um, and you can kind of see like all the screens that I had previously. So there's like the max screen. And then if I, let's see, let me stand on this bench actually. Let's see what happens here. And uh, let's see, let me try to make this window smaller. And then, yeah, like, uh, <laughs> feels like Counter-Strike, like a wall hacking or something like that. So there's a, a podcast screen there. You could see the succession image way back there. So some of these just appear through the walls, but uh, the distance is kind of captured there. Pretty interesting. Um, and yeah, that's that's a, just an example of how you might set this up, maybe a glimpse into the future of this stuff. Thanks for checking this out. Actually, now I just needed to stop it so that I could get the recording. I could show you like what I would do next here. Maybe not necessarily here, but um, let's see. So an iPad compatible app. One of them is LumaFusion. And then this is a good app for, oh no, uh, let's see. So I think if I put it right here, there, oh no. I press the button to like collect all my windows. So now they're all here. Uh, okay, whoop. Let me get to Luma Fusion. Okay, there we go. And you can actually, because I have all this other stuff, if you long press, you can go to hide other apps. And so now all I have is Luma Fusion. And you can see this is the, the demo that I just showed. Um, and then this is, yeah, just like I showed um, my fitness pal and then me walking into the gym, all of that that I just showed. So I'll be able to come in here do some editing. I probably won't do like a ton of editing um, here, but let's see. Uh, yeah, that's, that's it. So I'll probably do some trims and then post this, but thanks for checking this out.